Hi, my name's Ron Campbell. I'm the actual inventor of the posture cane and the whole biomechanics, candle hand, candle handle technology, etc. I'm working with a team of people actually from pretty much all over the world. We're working with people in Asia, uh, we're working with some friends in Korea, Vienna, Austria, uh, Michael Grease, who's a guy I'm teaming up with right now. We're dealing with some new innovations to introduce into Europe. And I've got a guy down in Belize now that's working on some uh, jungle sticks, new uh, the walking stick, simple, simple. Anyway, what we're trying to do now is we're working on new innovations for things in terms of dealing with things that we've learned from the Asians, uh, working with acupuncture products. We're working with my biomechanics, which now is really taking off. COVID kind of hit us hard, but now the world's starting to realize, I mean, I'm the most knocked off cane in the world, which is hilarious, but they're actually even using my name, uh, Campbell Posture Cane. We're finding out working with doctors, the biomechanics is completely different from anything that's on the market. Canes are great for people for taking pressure off the joints. The whole biomechanics on mine, slightly horizontal, wrist slightly forward, you grab a hold of something, even if you made it yourself. We've got adjustable devices that we're working on. The posture cane was the first one. I believe there's a lot more stuff that's cooler than this that's coming out very soon. Within the, probably by the end of the year. Our biomechanics works differently. When you grab a hold of something at about 90 degrees, slightly forward on the wrist from some old martial arts training, it takes the pressure off your wrist, off your shoulder, tightens the tricep muscle, and forces you to walk more erect. But an engineer put the whole thing together. An engineer came to me one time, he said, Ron, what's this you're working on? I told him we're working with a bunch of doctors for almost 40 years now. And he said, we're trying to change the biomechanics of a cane. He said, I can see what you're working on in terms of the other benefits and features. He said, you just changed an entire assistive device. I said, what do you mean? He said, you changed the line of sight. I didn't know what he was talking about. He said, your inner ear ceases to function when you look down at the ground or floor, like on a regular cane, assisted devices, and other things. The only way to make it work properly and more efficiently is for looking more horizontal and probably better than 45 degrees up. That's just the way it is. Well, we checked with my doctor friends, and they said, you go to a medical convention with us. I went to one. They said, you're going to the national one. We want you to show them what you're working on. We know what we've done. COVID kind of screwed things up a little bit, but I'm telling you, babe, the stuff we're working for, the things we want to work with for people with disabilities, we got some really cool stuff. Occupational therapists right now are really excited what I'm doing. A guy that I dealt with, Brett Sear, about .com from uh, Physical Therapy, he wants to see some of the new stuff I'm working on. He understands the biomechanics. He says, Ron, he said, I'm seeing my patients come in now with a posture cane. I may not have made it, but the whole idea of this thing was to make people safer. I did. And that was the whole mission. Okay. I hope to see some of you at this Disability Expo. Uh, it's something I've never been to before. It might be kind of fun. You get a chance, you see me, that's fine. Incidentally, I wore this for the inventors today. Okay. Think outside the box. Most of us inventors, we don't even know what the box is. Okay. But our job is to find things that are better for you. My specialty is dealing with balance and stability and safety for you as an individual. And I got a really cool thing for people that like swimming pools. I mean, this is really neat. Hope to get a chance to see you there. I'm going to be there probably maybe 10th, 11th, or 12th, somewhere around there uh, coming up soon. Thank you very much.